Well, here we are, and the question often is, how did we get here? I asked a couple that. Tell me your story. Everybody wants to hear a love story. And so they shared with me the story. I asked them, how did it begin? And Nick said, well, we were both interns together. I noticed this girl who was very funny and cute. We were doing a photo shoot for the Institute and I made a joke that any other girl might have taken the wrong way, but she came back with something 10 times funnier than what I said. <laughs> Nick came and asked me this. I want to know if I can have Vita's hand in marriage. I said, yes, but you know what you get yourself into. And he kind of looked at me, yeah. I was like, all right. to how she remembers it when she said that when she heard Nick was thinking about asking her out she said I was surprised because I hadn't thought of him in that way and Nick immediately piped up in our conversation and said but my devilish good looks got her in the end <laughs> that's my husband hey girl seriously thought about marrying her was the first time I told her that I loved her. We were dancing in Piper Thompson's driveway. I told her that I loved her and she said no. <laughs> A few minutes later she said she loved me too. sacrificial, never going to give up, unconditional love that is the love God has for us is called agape. It is this agape love, this commitment love. That's the kind of love that keeps a marriage strong. So Nick, is it your belief that God has brought Vida to you and that you are to make her your wife? Yes, sir. That was good. <laughs> Vita, it is your belief that God has brought Nick to you and it is his plan for him to be your husband. Yes. Nikita. <laughs> I promise to love you during the good, bad, and ugly. To always speak truth and love with scriptures to back it up. I vow to always lead you towards Christ, coming to always grow and never settle for where I am in my walk with Christ. What God has joined together, let no man put asunder. And if you may now kiss your bride. <laughs> you telling me or anybody the truth. And Nick, you are a humble leader. You could lift anyone's spirit just by spending time with them. And you are also so incredibly genuine. that the both of you are going to bring these qualities into your marriage and it's going to be filled with laughs and a lot of roasts and toasts and most importantly you're going to love one another and honor the Lord while doing that.
can't wait to see you. I can't wait to see you. <laughs> I pray that their marriage would be good, but not just good because they're good, but good because you are present and your blessing makes the difference. God will use both of you to grow each other out into the man and woman that he has prepared you to be. I love you both, and I'm excited for your future together.